Hi, everybody. I am so happy to be able to be with here with you today. Um, thank you for bearing with us. We had a few technical challenges, but we're now live online line and we have an amazing group of guests today. Um, we're in this period of time with the coronavirus where there is so much uncertainty in what is happening in our day to day lives. We're doing social distancing. We're staying at home, trying to protect ourselves and care for each other. And one of the things I think we're finding again and again through our practice, through the teachings of the Yungdun Bun, is that this is an incredible way for us to actually learn to be more connected to each other. And so what we'll be offering over the next hour to an hour and a half is we have His Holiness, the 34th Menry Treason, who will say a few words and offer prayers. We will then be visiting Menry Monastery and watching a butter lamp ceremony and prayers being offered for the sick, the dying, and the dead. From Menry Monastery in India, we'll be moving to Kenpo Tenpa Yungrun Rinpoche, who is the abbot at um, Tritan Norbutse Monastery in Kat, dark side of Kathmandu in Nepal. And after he offers prayers, we'll then watch at Tritan Norbutse as they also do butter lamp offerings for the sick, the dying, and the dead. And then finally, we'll turn to the United States, to California, where Tenzin Wangyu Rinpoche and his wife, Saring Wangmo, will be offering prayers as well. And they've lit butter lamps in their home, and we'll be able to watch and witness that finally. So we're so glad that you can be joining us for these things. And first, I'd like to introduce His Holiness Lungtak Darwa, Darwa Dargyal Rinpoche. He is the 34th Menri Treason, so the 34th lineage holder of this monastery, of Menri Monastery. He is also the spiritual leader of all of Yungdrin Bun. Um, he was selected uh, through an uh, extraordinary and ancient system of lottery on January 1st, 2018 following a process that included prayers and rituals to the Bundaris and protectors, and it is a lifelong appointment. We are so blessed to have him on, I think, his first live appearance um, for Western audiences on the internet. Thank you, Your Holiness, for being here with us today. Thomas Gilande Sezi Nangeyunla Nyeongne Chandre Shizinyo Tatale, Samig and Chinsata, Zambulin di Gangla, Jacoda, Saku, Nijal Hachi Nangola, Toyo Chizuni di Chabdechene, Mimang Bumta Mambuchi, La, Nate Gobadan, Tiana Sigi, Mimang Tata Mambuchi, and Nate Chimbigi. The Dego with Landin, Nanguore, the Dila Chundo Gajala Nare, Tiananchi, the Tempong Lingula Nare, Chiso Janjela Nare, the Dichi Nanin Chioina, the Ne, that Sosola Nazat Mangoig, Mongo Talam, Chebachin Jirel, and the Digi Landin, Pet and Pesimare, that Landin, the Ne Pepala. Maranso Mone Yang, Ji Della Zagutan, Dan Lane Shune, the Ji Gumbashi Dan in Naji, Ni Ping Tone, Gumbashi Jine, the D Sosola Gucho Mandoadan, Mi Shin Layan, Mangoa Ye, the Ji Pembaji Du Sambe Tone, and it is Odin Samade, Dan Lane Shituana, Maso Gesen over the Sangudu. Tikola 
ชุมิรุปะละนะติจิจิจิอยู่เรตะเปนะชุละติบายิงจิยินะนันโซชุนันละซวานันชิกะนิกิกุมะดึงไทลันดึงซวานันชิกะนันโซตะติเกจิยิน
Chin
Dungadinga Chamichirongtushu Thank you, Your Holiness, for the beautiful recitation of the Manlam Nansam and the dedication of merit. We're turning now from His Holiness to uh, an image of the uh, the monastery, Minri Monastery in Dolanji, India. This is the stupa that was prepared and consecrated in 2018 for His Holiness the 33rd Minri Treason, who was instrumental in the obtaining of the land in India, of helping lamas and students come, of creating the monastery. 
The original Menry Monastery was founded in Tibet in 1405 AD and was an important monastic center up until the Cultural, cultural Revolution in 1959. Through enormous effort, determination, and sacrifice, especially on the part of His Holiness the 33rd Menry Treason, Menry was reestablished in India in 1969. It was completed largely in 1978, though it continues to grow and expand. It is now the home of hundreds of monks, many young students, both boys and girls, in the school system there. And there's also across the valley a nunnery. Um, that has now instituted a Geshe's program similar to that of the monks. So please enjoy while the monks at Menry Monastery recite prayers as well. Thank 
thanks again both your holiness thank you so much for your prayers and your words and thank you to the monks of Menry monastery for your offering of the butter lamps and the prayers in front of the stupa we're turning now to nepal where we have kenpo tenpa younger rinpoche with us kenpo tenpa younger rinpoche is the abbot of both titan norbutse monastery in nepal and also of shenton dargailing in france he received his Geshe's degree in 1994 at Menri, and in 1996, he was appointed as the head teacher, or Tenpa, at Teton Norbutse. He then was appointed as Kenpo in 2001. Kenpo means the abbot, and he was appointed by both His Holiness Menri Trizen Nguyen Pache and His Eminence Yongzen Tenzin Namdok Rinpoche. He's taught many times in the West, and so many of you may already know him well, and we're so blessed to have you here with us to lead us in another prayer. Thank you, Kenpo. Uh, His Holiness Mary Tinsi Rinpoche, Tinsi Wanja Rinpoche, and all the Sangha members and, and friends. First of all, I would like to pay my respect and express many touch direct. Uh, today, the whole world is going through unprecedented crisis caused by COVID-19 pandemic. More than one and a half million people around the globe caught by the disease and nearly 98,000 people around the world died within five months. Many countries have been locked down all the people are living with panic, insecurity, and pain of great fear. We still don't know how long it will go on like this. It is not easy for everyone not to get panic and fear. 
but the fear will not bring any remedy. We all share this crisis and pain. What we can do is that we all should stay home, keep social distance, and implement the maximum safety measure for ourselves and for all the others. As a practitioner, it is very important that everyone should do whatever practice you are familiar with, do prayers, recite mantras, generate healing energies. This will certainly bring immense benefit for all the people. So in our monastery, we have been doing prayers uh, every day on a regular basis. And today, Tinsu Wanja Rinpoche and his Cyber Sangha team organized this online prayer event led by His Holiness, Mary Tinsu Rinpoche. I am happy to share this platform to express my feeling and pray prayers for all the people and particularly for those who died and who are still suffering by the disease. I'm going to say prayer of Tsewan Renzi, uh, which has been transmitted, orally transmitted by Tsewan Renzi himself to Zibu uh, Riparangshar. And this prayer is uh, particularly a uh, great benefit for uh, deaf people and also for this, uh, this kind of uh, crisis time. So uh, through this prayer, I wish and I deeply pray uh, for the pacification of this uh, epidemic and uh, restore all our peace and harmony in the world and in all the sentient beings and all the humanity. Thank you. Dagi Jizu Ninda Bede de Lama DJ Idaola Zoda, Tesom Jeras and Bagu Jizu. Uda goods of Dojo Bago, Imao, Inye, Lamda Jingara Jane. Lama DJ Idaola Zoda, Tesom Jeras, Sanje Simbeto, and Jane Nejo Mingaya. The Zodronam to Jesu Eji, Jizu Pime de la Juzo. Dona <laughs> Tommy je jula chawa jo jinge give parche ko je ne ke jo ta je je som tu ba ta te ba ta je ku je ri ne ja re je sim je ku la pen do jo mi ta tu je le tu chi ka ter lu je na za su se shi wa ta chu mo ti pe na wa ku sa ne de me sa da ri pa sa wa jo ji de de na tu ve le jo la re do che ta xin chai me ba ta ji ta bu ngo nyu mo ra xi ne Simji Nudor <laughs> 
ตุสินุสินตุสิจิวาตาตะเกคันยิจินตุคุเนจังเกเวตุนจินพุสุมซอบาชอมาตุมิเปตุนจิรับเจเนเลโลยิเวตุสิปันวาตาพุสุมชิ
like to thank Ken Potempa Younger and Rinpoche for his words in his prayer. Again, thank you so much. And also to all the monks at Trita Nobritsi Monastery. Um, for those who don't know, Trita Nobritsi was originally founded in the 14th century in Tibet, a very long time ago by a great master. It was refounded in Nepal in 1987 by His Eminence Tenzin Yangtzin, Yangtzin Tenzin Namdak Rinpoche. Um, and we're so blessed to have been able to witness these prayers and participate in them. We also want to make sure everyone knows that the prayer that Kempa Law read to us um, and reciting also the prayer that Tenzin Wangu Rinpoche and Sering Wangmo will be reciting, those are available at cybersangha.net as support practices for you. So if you'd like to get those and download them, you're welcome to do that. They'll stay there for some time. We are now moving to from India to Nepal to California to the home of Tenzin Wangu Rinpoche and his wife. Saring Wangmo, and they will continue our practice. So thank you, Rinpoche and Saring, for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, everybody, all our Cyber Sangha. So I wanted to, this candlelight prayer, I wanted to thank His Holiness, for being present. This is a special, really great gift for all of us, for his presence, his blessings, and also the monks from Mary Monastery for their prayers, and also Kempo Temba Yung and uh, uh, for his presence and his prayers, his blessings, and uh, monks from Chitin Orbuche, what we just heard, uh, prayers from there. So it's wonderful to be able to uh, coordinate and collaborate this uh, joint prayers together from different parts of the world in this moment where very much needed. I am here at our home in California. My wife Chang is here with me mm -hmm. and uh, I I am hoping that Singe will be here also with us but this is a little too early so he is doing his prayers in his bed. <laughs> so, but we are very happy to be here. And um, um, also I wanted to thank our president, Lingmaja International, Rob, uh, who being the host here today. So always uh, being available for so many different tasks. And of course, and our Cyber Sangha team behind the scene, our translator, Tenzi uh, Samla, who is also behind the scene here, was translating. And as we all know, at this moment, over 1.6 million people who are uh, sick and um, also like almost close to 100,000 100, people have been passed away. And so many people have lost their life. So many people have lost their loved ones. So. Sometimes I feel that we worry about ourselves so much, people who are alive and uh, what is going to happen and so on. I, I completely understand and I time to time feel the same, but we also, I think it's really important 
that we have to remember that people who have lost their life, they also really need attention and prayers. And people who also are sick right now, this very moment, sometimes we get telling and we just got some messages yesterday, some friends of ours who, whose brother is sick. And, um, and so there are a lot of people's loved ones, close ones, friends who are also sick there and really need a prayers. So I wanted to, uh, you know, we all remember all these people. So we want to do our prayers here, Pardo Molam, and uh, all of you, uh, there is a text in the cybersangha.net prayer there. So you're welcome to, you know, uh, sing that. And those you don't know, you are also welcome just to do the Om Matimu Salendo. I think, uh, I'm not sure now. Today we are turning into YouTube. I'm not sure how it's working. And, uh, but uh, maybe Anya, if there's any way you can post, that would be great. If not, the cybersangha.net, there is a mantra there. Jai Jai Lo, 
Oh, 
Thank you, everybody. Um, our apology for some technical problems that we faced this morning with the Facebook Live. We were not able to transmit through it, but uh, thanks to Rob and Anya and the last minute and Polly behind there also figured out how to make this work. Uh, if, if they were not there, this would not have happened this morning. So. Thank you, three of you. Really appreciate. And so something that we don't have to worry about, you know. At least I have to do the my computer to show our shrine. The that part I have to do use my hand. <laughs> Other than that, it's good. So as these are dedicated to people who are sick and dying, and also, you know, there are a lot of people who are deep in fear and anxiety, and people who are you know, handling all the situations in the hospitals. And you see a lot of uh, people who are really, really having a difficult time. So, uh, and the cheer practice is wonderful things to cutting through the fear, uh, working with the fear, transforming fear. And so tomorrow morning, um, same time, I think it's one o'clock uh, New York time, we will have a, 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 some of our other tradition Anam Tutin Rinpoche and Dr. Yang Dun and also uh, Anna Yang Shin here, they were going to do the cheer practice. I have inv invited them on my Facebook page. So I hope you were able to participate. And also, you know, all around the world and particularly here in the US, we supposed to really, this week supposed to be a really, really a bad week and also next week. So a lot of, lot of people are dying. So I would, in saying and we would uh, love to offer another session of the Pardo prayer, the two of us here. And so um, we don't know the, uh, the schedule yet. We will let you all know in our Facebook page. And uh, so, and then the Pardo prayers are also there. And those you wanted to join, singing at your own place. So you're welcome to print them out before you join us next time, sometime next week. Um, and also we will be happy to receive all the names that people you know who are sick and dying. Please, uh, if Anya, if there's somewhere, cybersanga.net, somewhere, I don't know exactly where you can send. Names will be great. Images will be great. We were hoping to at least print some of the images, but we, you know, we don't have the right printer. We cannot go out. So we were not able to print the images of people's name, but at least if we were to receive the names, we will definitely write down the name and during our part of the prayer and, and think of everybody's name there. So please, uh, you know, do that. So we will let you all know. So finally, thank you all. Thank everybody. Um, I think, uh, so I guess see you tomorrow. Thank you.